hello hello welcome back to divine destiny guide i'm back with another message i hope you're doing well wherever you are sending you the purest of love and light so based on the pre-shuffle a lot of you you're gonna maybe you're gonna hear maybe not but it's probably even happening now a lot of people are in despair a lot of people are sad because of you know the things that they invested the decisions that they made and everything is now backfiring on them and so but you know persons won't be honest they will not be honest and say that it's because of what they have sown that they are reaping and so they will still go around and make it seem as if you're the one who hurt them you know, it's like at first they they did all of that lies to turn people against you. Now, when they're getting, they're receiving everything that they threw out there for you, it's backfiring on them. Now they're still going to say, look, this is what he or she did to me. Again, not taking responsibilities for their actions. So a lot of people are sad right now they're in, in despair whether it's out of a job you know their life is falling apart a lot of these people they are dropping like flies things in their lives are dropping like flies it's like their life or their lives are falling apart this is 32 5 you know a lot of change is happening or will be happening around you in the lives of these people who were hurting you and here we have the first card it says bad health bad health for a main male you know probably this person uh tried to come off to others as if he was this mature man who is on top of his business who is in his path in his mission and uh, you know as if they were responsible but I'm telling you, there's going to be a lot of message of concern, concern, flow coffin in the community, even imprisonment. People are going to be going to court and a lot of it, you know, it's about money. You know, people had this false persona going on and yes, everything is backfiring. The things that they chose, like I said, adjudication. So, you know, it's like a ruling for these people. I'm telling you, despair. A lot of these people, they're losing it or they're going to lose it big time. It's like the ruling will not be going in their favor. And so a lot of these people are going to be very unhappy at this time. Or like I said, you know, in the near future. Yeah, wealthy man. You know, is this mature man? So maybe this person who was putting off as if they were this main man, you know, it's a divine masculine, or again, take it how it resonates as if they're a divine feminine. They were not, you know, they were probably making it seem as if they have business, they have things going on in their life when really nothing was going on for this person they were actually false they were living a double life actually yeah false this person in bad health is a false person man or woman and here it says mature woman so this person again could be pulling it off as if she was a mature woman as if she had it all together you know wanted to show people you know our make it seem as if what she has to say matters but no you know it's like no they're not this official person at all they want it to seem as if they're official you know again coffin an end to this person who wanted it to seem as if they're official in prison so these people are persons they're gonna meet it really bad you know for a lot of you yeah it's not gonna go too well for a lot of these people like i said some of you you're gonna hear about it some of you you're not family room 
you know these are people whom you were accustomed to yeah they were thieves or they are thieves for the ones who are still carrying on this lifestyle they're false and they're a thief so this person probably was going around fulfilling a fantasy again lying to people have people up in their head you know tricking people that they are businessmen businesswomen and probably just taking people's money wasting people's time you know it's like having this big talk but pretty much they have nothing to back it up so they were only living a dream it was all a fantasy and now this person is kicked to the curb you know it's like god have nothing to do with this bugaboo you know it's like they're an idiot so a lot of these people they are really really going to see that you know god is not to be messed with now they want to do this fake apology burning evidence a lot of these people are burning evidence wow with the judication here so a lot of these people they know that the things that they have been doing or were doing in the background that it, it's wrong very shady and so now they're trying to get rid of evidence so that it won't be used against them in court and some of them they may want to come back or you know will come back to give you an apology but just so you know it's fake some of you in court you're gonna get a divorce breaking a contract if it's a business partner you know and i'm telling you people are going to be in despair they're gonna be very sad based on the outcome of the ruling this quote-unquote wealthy man is going to be depressed yeah because game is over it's finished it's like they are exposed people are finding them out they will be found out you know their whole life was a total drama action it was like a, a movie you know again they were only fulfilling a fantasy it's like they had this child childhood or childish dream of this life that they want to live you know but again it's outdated expired it's old news it's discarded it's like they're played out so it's finished i'm telling you they are dropping like flies it's like they're at the end of the road it's like a dead end there is nowhere to turn they are you know yeah it's it's, it's finished it's over game over it is finished for these false people here yeah destroyed shattered broken they're messed up this false person man or woman they are destroyed it's like whatever it is their reputation people found out or they're finding out that they were only putting on a show that's all it is they were putting on a show very dramatic they're toxic now he or she they're in their feelings a lot of these people probably turn into sex and other um things to fulfill their you know void the emptiness in their life the empty space that is in their life let's see this official man or official person they're actually outdated expired disuse yeah it's like you know it's like maybe at one point or one time in their life they were able to charm people use their charisma now a lot of people already know the tea a lot of people already know the truth about this person here and it's like they're approaching them with caution basically yeah Ooh, wow oh wow yeah so these people you know it's like they weren't emotionally intelligent just give me a moment let me get these cards so many fell out yeah 
Yeah, a lot of these people were very envious of you and what you have going on. Now they are left in their feelings. Yeah, the word, I'm going to tell the tea. I'm spilling it. And they don't like it. Again, in the family room, envy. The envy card came back out. So a lot of people were probably envious of you. You know, um, maybe some of these, you know, you're breaking a contract. You're divorcing this person or, you know, whomever they are. But you're severing your connection with these people whom you had a close relationship with in this family room here so whether they're blood related you know or whomever you're you're walking away from these connections here yeah you realize this person they were a bugaboo and you made a bad choice this person was a bad choice yeah, it's like you're not realizing, you know, for a lot of you, it was only uh, sex, really. There was nothing substantial there in that partnership. So you're realizing it was a bad choice. So, yeah, so with bad health, there is death. So this person, they thought it was a game. They thought it was a joke to play with your life. You know, to go around and do whatever, say the most, do the most. Because for them it was funny. But here, death, you know, is like easier to collect. And you can see on the ground, the crown and everything. Again, this person probably thought that they had it going on like that because we saw it they were they thought they were this main male divine person they wanted people to give them respect as if they were this mature person and yes it's like death is here to collect this person man or woman bad health king of swords and if you look at these pictures i don't know hopefully you can see with the death and here it looks like the same person the crown is on the floor again this person probably they have the gift of gab they talk a lot with the sword they thought they were smart it's like they think that nobody would know what they're doing you know yeah it's like this person probably go around giving people gifts you know probably pay off a lot of people too so again to make it seem as if they were all that they would go around giving people gifts bribing people you know to make it seem as if they are wealthy when in fact it was all a fantasy again we saw they they were they're thieves so it's like they steal from other people to go around to make it seem as if you know they are making money or they have money adjudication Yep, adjudication, justice, karma is here for this person or these people here. Karma is here to collect. You know, again, there could be a queen of wands, somebody very witchy, very jealous, very lustful. We see, you know, earlier with a lot of the cards that talk about SEX. So a lot of these people, you know, male or female, use their body a lot you know, to get what they want so that's how probably they were enticing some people to to get their my, their money as well i saw also the card sex shop too mm -hmm. four of swords you know this is like they're gonna be laid out again death yeah god is putting this situation to rest this person is now very depressed because the game is over. It's like they're finished. They're finished. All this persona is finished right here with the sun. Exposed. This is exposure. 
It's like whatever was done in the dark, it's now coming to light with the judgment right behind it and the world closing out these karmic toxic cycles here. Wow. So now this or these false persons, they're now destroyed because everybody see that they're putting on a show. Nobody's taking their word. Yeah, he's like six of swords. Everybody's moving on to calmer water. Nobody's, you know, waiting. Nobody's trying to listen to what they have to say, basically, because everybody found them out. So people are leaving them. They're they're moving away from them. It's like the persons who probably were buying whatever they were selling. They are tempering out the situation. They're balancing it out because they're seeing through the fog. For a lot of these people, you know, they're seeing too that you are an earth angel. And God moved you away from this fall situation as well. Yep. That was tied to the devil. It's like they, this person, they were tied to the devil. People are moving away from them. And it's like, you know, weighing the options, like, oh my goodness, this was all an act for this person all along. It's like they got caught up in something. This person was putting on a show. It's only that they didn't know that it was a show. So it's like the blind was actually leading the blind here. Yeah. So you already know the T. This person... They're of no eye on her. They're a liar. They're a liar. They're a scam. You know, they're fake. And for a lot of you, you're holding back from this person. Uh, this could even, you're holding back your money. For some of you, again, you know, you could have loved this person at one point because we saw the divorce card. So you could have been married to this person. And you're realizing, no. And again, see this person, Page of Cups, they may want to come back to apologize. We saw that. But remember that apology, it's fake. It's fake. You're holding back from this person. Yeah. They are now in the Eight of Swords. And we saw the imprisonment card came out before. So a lot of these people, I'm telling you, it's mental conflict. It's torture for them because they were envious of you. You know, whatever you have, maybe for some of you, you have a beautiful home. It's the way you look, whatever it is they were going after. But again, these are people that you could have been very close to, you know, and you realize that, you know, you made a bad choice. The, this person, these people, you know, they're, they're nuts. Eight of Swords, they are imprisoned, you know, a lot of you. They could have wanted you to be trapped as well. You know, the star here. Yeah, they wanted you to miss something. An opportunity. Yeah. Yeah, it could have been with your work. They were doing things to really affect your job. And the Six of Cups. Like I said, this is somebody who... Or people from your past you have memories with. This is somebody who could have put you in an in like put you as an option. And you walk away. You walk away here. You know, with the hierophant and the lovers. Again, you could have been married to this person or have some contract with this person. Yeah, now they're left out in the cold. I can't make it up. And then we have the ace of swords. This is the truth. This is the truth. It's like this person, these people, they're left confused with the two of sword. They're trapped, you know, and the ten of wands, a lot of burdens now they have to carry because of what they have done to you, because of what they did. So they have to live with this, you know, loose lips, sing ships. So like I said, the king of swords, this is somebody who are queen of swords. They talk a lot. 
a lot of unsolicited advice as if they know everything but it's like at the same time they can't help themselves you know like they'll go around and say oh i help so and so to start a business or you know just make themselves seem important more important it's an inflated ego that they have and at the same time they can't create a business for themselves they can't do anything so what they do they just try to charm people or they use their bodies to see what they can get now this person these people they're they're sick they're in bad health and here we have they're in court some of them they're gonna be divorced lose a contract a partnership if they're coming back the apology is fake yeah a lot of these people they were doing their acts or their deeds right under your nose yeah queen of wands very witchy male or female doing spells you know to kind of create illusions so you wouldn't see who they are and these people are this person now that they're caught up they're burning evidence they're trying to get rid of evidence of all the things that they were doing in the background yeah now they're caught in the web of lies you know so yeah i'm telling you it's like whatever trap they set for you they caught up in it the harder they come the harder they fall i mean this person came as if they are done dada you know wealthy man they have it all together now everything the game is over they are now depressed they're laid out they're sick you know they're unalive you know because they're exposed so it's like there is nothing else to do the harder they come the harder they fall he came in big and heavy he or she as if they are you know a hot stepper they and now it's like they're falling publicly with the sun you know is everything is now blown open everything is out in the open and again they're caught in their own web of lies so people are realizing this person these people again they're thieves and it could be a lot of people here working together we saw community earlier as well you know look a thief does not like to see another thief with long bag this is all and the thief card is underneath there so yeah so these people you know are this person they are they are desperate now everybody realize that they're a liar you know it's like a thief doesn't like to see another thief with long bag so it's like a person who is already a thief or somebody who wants to say marry for money immediately they will try to project that onto you because they know that's exactly who they are so that's what it is so a lot of people are coming to this understanding and with the temperance is like they're balancing out their feelings is like maybe before they were hot and passionate with this person or people they believe them and now people are realizing okay you are not that kind of person you're actually an earth angel and people are moving away people are moving away look judas kiss yeah so like i said for a lot of you this person could be very close to you because think about it, judas was one of the disciples right and uh, who do you allow to get so close to you to kiss you it's somebody you're comfortable with like again right under your nose yeah you're realizing that not every family is your relative so you know with this ten of cups you were married to somebody you have people you share home with or whatever close friendship not every family's relative is your relative you know they're not as 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 loyal as you thought and now people are realizing that you're a force to be reckoned with and it says if you want good your nose must run so a lot of you whatever you have or you're doing you work very hard for it and this person here was probably living off of you whether you were married to them again however the relationship is but you're realizing what you thought it was for you it wasn't the same for them because this is why they didn't take it seriously 
So you thought you were probably in a serious marriage. This person, what it was just a dream. It's a fantasy. It was a movie for them. It was a show. Whatever they could get away with, that's what they wanted. You know, so belief kills and belief cures. Yeah, this person, they throw rocks and hide their hands. So for a lot of you, again, you realize that you made a bad choice here with this person. You know, probably had you trapped in your head, wanted you trapped. No, they are trapped when it comes to your work. They wanted you to be stuck, left out in the cold. No, they are. So for a lot of you, you learn from that where you learn... Like I said, belief kills and belief cures. So you're taking things people say to you with a grain of salt. You're not just going wholeheartedly with what people, what they say. Because you're realizing a lot of people, they are not who they are. And you made a bad choice in the past by just believing somebody, taking their words for it, probably projecting that somebody's doing something to them. When in fact, they're the ones who have been in the background throwing rocks and hiding their hands right underneath your nose. This queen of wands, king of wands. I mean, this person, these people and the persons who join them. Yes, justice, karma is here on, on your behalf and theirs too. It's like a lot of these people, yeah, they're going to get it really big. So let's get a few angel messages here. Spiritual gifts, Archangel Raziel. Thank you, Raziel, for helping me challenge my gifts and talents. So for a lot of you, you're very gifted. You're using your gifts to help other people as well. Take a step back. Thank you, angels, for helping me to step back from what is not serving me. Absolutely. It's like God is in control, you know, even in the courtroom, wherever. For a lot of you, you gave the situation over to God. Honor your beauty. Thank you, Jophiel, for helping me discover my inner and outer beauty. Yes, embracing who you are. Okay? You're realizing, you know, like with this wealthy man, a lot of you are probably used to going off of the exterior of a person, but it's like, what about the inside? What about the heart? You know, beauty should be inside and out. So a lot of people, you know, like the Bible says, oh, they are just a whitewashed sepulcher. On the outside, they look beautiful, but inside, you know, we they're filled with dead man's bones, stinky, attitude bad. You know, their ways, it's not good. They're thieves, they're con artists. Take time to breathe. Thank you, angels. I breathe with ease knowing you are here. Absolutely. So a lot of you, you're earth angels too. And people were doing these things to you. And, you know, God move your way. And now you can finally breathe. You will be able to breathe. Well, you know, again, the table is turned. Move your body. Thank you, angel, for motivating me to move my body and my energy. Again, a lot of these people wanted you stuck. And now you'll be able to move, you know, move your body, whether it's exercise, whether it's moving about, going about. You'll be able to do that. Unconditional love, the Divine Mother. Thank you, Divine Mother, for helping me to give and receive the love I deserve. Absolutely. So a lot of you, yeah, you're going to meet people, your soul tribe, your soul family. People who are going to be honest with integrity, fear, loyal, unconditional love. It's not dry weather. It's not seasonal. It's not based on what you do for them. No sweet talkers or charmers but people who are loving people with your heart you know to give to you because you are love you deserve love and it says a loved one in heaven thank you loved ones in heaven for joining close at this time so a lot of you your angels your ancestors and your guides they they came through to help to protect you looking out for you as you were going through this they saw what was going on you know, whether it's from families, close friends, business partners, whomever. 
who wanted to trap you or trick you but self-awareness is good you know i love this card how you realize you know it's a bad choice this person these people you know it's like you picked up snakes and brought them in your home and you own it you own your part in it and that's a part of the healing journey too owning taking responsibility for the role you played forgiving yourself forgiving them and giving it to god because in the end we'll see here we see here that justice god does not miss anything and we have the sun so the clarity everything you know everything is exposed here for you i love this for you i love it for us until next time take care and be blessed